It's interesting to work on this play because I've realized that some of the topics that come up in Clyburn Park in the play and that they talk about are things that I personally feel quite uncomfortable talking about and I think that's the point. Do you find when you're standing in the aisles at Gelman's, does it generally strike you as the kind of market where you could find the particular foods your family enjoys? It's a very nice store. What if we were to say this? Mr. Gelman's a nice man. But I mean your preferred food items. Would such things even be available at Gelman's? Do they carry collards and pig feet? Because I sure couldn't shop nowhere that didn't sell no pig feet. I don't know that we'll ever get rid of the issue of race. It's getting better. Mm -hmm. It's getting a lot better, but but uh, I but see it. it yeah. Does seem to be like one of one of I don't know how many truly taboo topics there are, but like it feels to me like that's got a sort of a taboo association to it. Like it's not a thing that that people want to get into as a discussion. Would your family? I assume you have children. Three children. Oh, soon. So with your children, might this be the sort of place, bearing in mind that they too would stand to be affected? This is confusing things. It's confusing. It's a very lovely issue. neighborhood. No, be honest. We want you to say it. I think what Jim is asking, in his way... He means living next to white folks. I, I, I... It was more overt in 1959. People didn't worry about what they said in front of black people. Mm -hmm. In this day and age, I think it's, it's kind of gone under the surface. There was a great article two weeks ago, I don't know if you saw this, about the history of the changing uh, ethnic distribution of the neighborhood and how in the 70s, 80s, how that was followed by a period of, 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 of rapid decline, of no, growth, I mean, of no, growing. I mean, there was trouble. Not trouble. Oh, she didn't there was trouble. Economic trouble. Drugs are trouble. That's what I'm saying. Violence is trouble. Exactly. And the violence as an outgrowth of the criminalization of those drugs. Because you know, the two of us was both crackheads. But it's still kind of sitting there and simmering. And if you go deep enough, then you kind of, you'll see it. But and all not. tied into these ideas of political correctness and what it is to, to say the right thing or the wrong thing and to be afraid of saying the wrong thing or to know that there could be a wrong thing to say right. even is something that is kind yeah. of prevalent now. Like yeah. and I th but I think that's what's really funny too at the same time. Yeah.